back again. Need people to like, subscribe, share. Trying to make a page, and I need your help. Other than that, though, back again. You know, I start with the Facebook platform first because something happened when I tried it on YouTube and it just, I don't do it that way. I don't like doing it that way. Anyways, man, look, man, you have a lot of people saying 50 50. You know, um, they'll say if a man wants 50 50, then he's not a man and this and that. And, you know, that this 50-50 thing, man, I don't know why people think it's based off all on money. I don't I don't understand that. Like, there's more to a relationship than money. There's more ways to contribute to a relationship than money. And if, when, if any woman feels like a man asking for 50-50 is wrong, then that woman probably is just in a relationship for herself. That's like a man... Uh, getting uh, mad because a woman asked for 50 50. Like, he probably just in it for herself. It is what it is, man. You know, a woman, and, and when you say 50 50, you know, for some reason, people think you're just automatically, you talking about money. It could be any fucking thing. The man might not even want you to work. He might just want you to do other shit around the house. Who knows? Everybody's relationship is different. But at the end of the day, man, 50-50 to me means like if you see the person with more weight, dealing with more weight on this day or that day or whatever, you you um sacrifice. You don't you don't sit back and say, hey, you're the woman. I'm not doing that. Or I'm the man. I'm not doing that. You don't do that, man. You see the you see your partner struggling, you take up for, you know, you you uh make up for the slack for that day. Or should I say you give them slack for that day? By helping them out or whatever. You don't get a book out and start reading rules and shit. Oh, this is what a man does. This is what a woman does. I, I can't help you there. And uh, Come on, man. Y'all y'all be doing some shit that I just don't get, man. A lot of shit shouldn't even be looked at that way. It just shouldn't be. Let's be honest about it. You know, and, and all this money shit all the time. And it's just dumb, man. Are y'all going to be in relationships with each other or are you fucking not? Pick one. Because if you want to do all this single shit and all these rules and regulations, just stay to yourself. Don't even get with nobody because it's not going to work anyway. Because y'all just going to be bumping heads and arguing over fucking everything. See, when people, when two people actually are trying to um, please each other instead of always me, 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 they don't care about sacrificing or they don't care about, okay, I'll do the laundry today or this or that. You don't even got to ask them twice. Because they they looking at the, they they're looking at their partner like okay I know they are tired or something let me do this it ain't no oh I can't do this or I can't do that or you owe me this and I need that and all this calculations and all this shit man that shit ain't relationships man that's more like a fucking transactional fucking um, agreement or some shit you know everybody say love is harder to find now love ain't harder to find it's just that people have turned it into transactional benefits instead of transactional intimacy. You know, and that is facts, man. I don't understand. If a, if, if, if a woman is with the right man, she ain't got to do all these, you don't got to uh, do all these schemes and plots to uh, get a man to buy you this and buy you. He's already going to want to do it. Same thing vice versa with the men. You don't got to run all these plots on people who actually want to fuck with you. So I've come to the conclusion that a lot of people are fucking with people who really don't want to fuck with them. That's why it's like pulling teeth to get this motherfucker to do this or do that and all this bullshit. They should already be wanting to do it and you should already be wanting to do it vice versa. That's how motherfuckers are happy. But all this, oh, I'm putting all this weight on you and all this weight on you too and this and this and I ain't doing nothing. I, I, I just please me. And it's just stupid, man. Why get in a relationship if you're not going to try to benefit somebody? It's supposed to be both ways. Yeah, why get in it if you're not benefited? Yeah, I get that. But it's, what about the other part? See, people only want that one part. Benefit me, 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 me. They don't want to uh, benefit you. They don't want to take time or energy or any of that. 
to eat, try to make you feel good. It's all about them, and that's the only reason why they in a relationship half the time, any fuck away. A lot of people are only in relationships for their own benefit, and that's why relationships don't work. People want to know why did the relationships work better back in the day with your grandma and all that, because they actually believed in fucking caring and love and all that bullshit, and they actually wanted to please each other. You know, they didn't just get in relationships for what you could do for me. It wasn't just what you could do for me. That's the problem. Nothing is wrong with looking at, okay, this person could do this. They got potential to be this and nothing's wrong with that. But you got to be looking at yourself too. What can I do for them? Can't just look at what they can do for you. You got to be able to look at yourself too. Okay, let me do this. What where, where can I uh, make this person happy here or there? And it ain't always about money. That person might have more money than you. You could find other ways. You see, the person might be, some people say, oh, that person is ugly. Why is he, why is he or she with that person? Maybe that person might not be uh, uh, that good looking to you. Maybe they might not think that way. Or maybe they don't care about looks. Or maybe they make up for it in other ways. There's all kind of things that can go on. You know, it's not one set way to just love somebody. People got this book in their fucking head that this is the only way that you can love somebody. And it's just dumb, you know. A lot of men think, oh, I'm not washing no dishes. That's a woman's job. I'm not cleaning my clothes. That's a woman's job. All these things. That's bullshit. That's no different than a woman saying, you're the man. Where's my money? It's the same thing. You're the man. I don't pay the bills. Where's my money? It's, it don't make no fucking sense. You know, a, a woman that is in a relationship with you is not going to uh, be like, oh, shit, the fucking water bills do. Yeah, let me call him. Instead of paying this water bill right now before it cut off, I, I got to call the man and make him pay for it. It's dumb. You know, man's not going to be off for two days and know his woman tired and he see all these uh, fucking clothes everywhere. Uh, you know what? She's the woman. Let her do it. Nah, it don't work that way. They're going to pick up your slack because when you are in a relationship with somebody just trying to really be with you, they try to actually make you happy. Just like you try to make them happy when you're trying to be with somebody. If you don't see that, you know, especially after so long, then I don't know what to tell you, man. It probably ain't real, you know? And another thing, the social media, I seen a post. Uh, said uh, is it okay for men to look at like it said like a woman's booty pictures I'm going to tell you like this like as far as men and women I told y'all man I don't care if I have a girlfriend I don't care if she looks at other men but don't let them know you're looking at them don't let me know you see that you're a human being. I don't, I'm don't. i not a jealous person. You're a human being. I don't give a fuck if you look at other men. You're going to do it any fucking way. But if you do it in front of me or you're doing it and letting them know, like, hey, look at me, like, 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 and you got a girlfriend or a boyfriend, that's wrong, man. I don't give a fuck what anybody say. You're insecure. Man, fuck what you say about the insecurity. Say what the fuck you want. It's wrong. It's wrong, man. Because you are based when you, this is why it's wrong. This is the nail in the coffin why it's wrong. When you are when you are happy with a woman or man, you don't seek the attention or you don't desire to seek the attention from someone else and you don't really want it from somebody else. Yes, yeah, cool, whatever, but you really want the attention from the person you're with because you're happy with them. You're content. You don't need to, I'm telling you, I know what it's like to be content. I know what it's like to be with a woman and I'm satisfied. I see, yeah, yeah that ass looks nice, that's nice, but you, it don't go there. You don't go there like that. You see it, but you're not all in it. Oh, look at me, like, like, like. Plus, what if your girlfriend see it, right? Or your boyfriend see it? Now you, now you, now you could be hurting their feelings, or making them look a certain way, make them not trust you as much, make them look at you different. Why would you even jeopardize that? Just like if a, if I, if I have a girlfriend and all her girlfriend friends are over, I'm not gonna be in there talking to them all in their face, glick giggling and shit. Hi, bye. How y'all doing? Y'all need anything? I'm going over here. I'm doing this shit. I'm not going to be all in their conversation, smiling all her, in her friend's face and all that bullshit. For what? Why? Why would I even want to plant that seed in her mind to even make her think that I'm trying to holler at her friends or make her friends even think that? Shit, Tawana don't look like he's happy with his girlfriend. He, tried, he always smiling in my face and all that. Y'all don't get it, man. And this is why people, people want different people all the time anyway because they, they don't know how to control the fact that Yes, as a human being, you're always going to find other people attractive and all this other shit, but they don't know how to control the, the satisfaction of just being satisfied with one motherfucker. They can't do it. They cannot. I promise you they can't do it. And that's why so many people are for everybody. 
because it's it's not something that it's just something that just happens. This is something that you have to uh, program yourself to be, you know. In other words, I'm always going to be a man. I'm always going to see nice asses every fucking where. But if I got a girlfriend, I need to program myself not to disrespect that person or even lead people on or try. This is how cheating starts happening. You start tampering with shit. You start flirting with shit and all this other shit. It's wrong. So the answer to that person's question is, is clearly wrong. Oh, shit, I'm glad I got in my car. I need some gas. So that, that worked out perfect. Anyways, man, it's wrong, man. You know, people can say insecure and all this and nobody got time for that. I don't feel like no man's better than me. But uh, if my woman is letting you know that she likes all your fucking body pictures and shit, I have a problem with that. You know what I mean? Just like if I would have done it, vice versa. I know she got a problem with it. So why would I do it? Why am I trying to make you acknowledge that I like you so much? You're not my girlfriend. I could look at it and nobody even know but me and God. Like, yeah, she got a nice body, blah, blah. That's it. Cause I'm a human, right? But I ain't gotta be doing it, letting, liking, and getting. It's stupid, man. I don't give a fuck what y'all say, man. That shit matters. People take this like shit on social media, and, and when you're in relationships, as it's it's nothing. It's just people insecure and all this bullshit. No, it ain't. Cause cause it speaks value. Why would you do it? That's the whole point. Why would I do it? Even if the woman, even if I got a woman, she's not insecure. Why would I do that? Why would I constantly like pictures of other women? For what? That's why it's wrong. Because you are seeking the attention or you're trying to give your attention to someone else. Plain and fucking simple. No other way around it. Oh, it's just a like button. Just like men say, oh, it's just hoes and, and I love you. I'm only fucking them, but I love you. That's the same thing. I'm only liking their pictures, but I love you. Same thing. You still, you still flirting this shit, man. It's not good. It's not good for your relationship. It could lead to a bad thing. So, you know, even if you even if you might you might be happy with your girlfriend or boyfriend, but you keep flirting with enough motherfuckers, you might fuck around and cheat or something. And or even worse, they might think you're cheating. Cause you know how it go this day. Shit, how you know who to trust half the time? You really don't. You really don't, man. And trust it, believe me, if somebody respects you, man, they not trying to put that out there to you like that. They not trying to, you know, uh, you know, I respect my woman. Let me get this straight. People say a motherfucker respects you, but he click and like on every fucking thing. Always. And, and another thing, instead of spending time with you, you right here, and he on social media talking to every fucking woman. Or vice versa, a woman on social media talking to every fucking man in the world got a man right here. How's that? What? What do y'all get from that? I know what I get from it. Speaks value to me. I don't give a fuck what y'all say, man. You know what I mean? Everybody got their own opinion. That's fine, man. But to me, no reason for it. No reason, people. So I'm going to let y'all go, man. Get my food, get my gas, you know, 50-50 shit. Uh, that could be all type of ways. Women are providers too. Women got kids and all that. Women are providers too. Provider is more than just fucking money. Get it out your mind that it's all money in, and a man's a, a man's a provider. A woman's a provider too. You know, 50-50, man. Do y'all not understand what this means? That don't mean that everything's all cut down the middle. Oh, she makes the same as me. Or or I watched the dishes last night, so you're watching them tonight. Nah, she tired, I'll do it two days in a row or something. It don't matter. You go with the flow of the fucking shit. Shit, she might have a she might have a uh, hurt foot or something for about two months. I wash the dishes and do the laundry for now. Or do I say, oh, you're a woman. That's a woman's job. Or maybe a man's hurt. Does he say, does a woman say, you're the man, you're the provider. I know you can't hurt, you're hurt and you can't go to work. So unless you get up on your hurt leg and go to work, we about to lose our whole house and stuff. Because I'm the woman and I don't have to fucking work because it's 50-50. Even though that's contradicting like a motherfucker. Think about it. A lot of shit is contradicting. Everybody say 50-50. But they got all these rules and regulations. 50-50 don't have no fucking rules and regulations. Not not rules and regulations of, oh, I'm only going to do this if you do that. That sounds fake to me. That's like somebody saying, uh, you know how people will only give you shit because they expect something back in return? That's fake. So I'm going to give you this $20. Yeah, I'm going to give her this $20, but I expect her to give me some head later or whatever, this or that. That's fake. Or I'm going to ask him for something later. I, yeah, I'm going to give him his money now, but I'm asking for something bigger later. So you really didn't give it to him. It was bait to get what you want. Think about this shit. 
That's the same thing when people got all these rules and regulations to this 50 50 shit. You know, I'm only going to do this if he does that or she does this. It's dumb, man. I'm out of here, man.